I'm back. Norwood Sucks, Balding, Bare Bones Broadcasting. This is, uh, what morning is it? Tuesday, I think. 5.57. I woke up a little earlier this morning. I just couldn't sleep any longer. I go to bed pretty early and wake up pretty early. I don't know why. I got into that rut. Here I am. Anyway, it's um, March 27th, year 19, 2012. This is Bare Bones Broadcasting. I'm a radio broadcaster, and YouTube is assisting my failure in the radio. <clears throat> Thank you, YouTube. Thank you, whatever watching this. I hope you enjoy it. It's more than hope. It's an intention. That I want to remind you what took place with me. I born with a birth defect. I'm going to rat on him. I'm ratting. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm coming out of the closet right now. And I'm ratting. I was born in 1945 in the United States of America and sent into surgery immediately at birth. Normally, something like me died. Well, they rushed me into surgery, very defective individual, and they implanted something back here as they fixed me. We're going ahead. I'm, I'm, I'm bionic in a way. My mind is extremely bionic. And with that implant, I feel things <laughs> that aren't there. And there was nothing there and I felt it. And it's just my nervous system is about a pile of malarkey. And every time you feel things on you that aren't there, nothing on the outside of you, idiot, that's your nervous system malfunctioning. Is there anything going on with this planet right now that is not your nervous system malfunctioning? Anything. Right now. All the names. All the identity. All of it. Nervous system malfunctioning with humanity. All of it. Is there? Now let's say we get it fixed. How do we get that nervous system fixed? If we get it accurate, we get this android functioning. Are there any challenges left for the android? I don't know. Planet issues that have nothing to do with the failure of humanity's nervous system. What a bat! And while you're monkeying around with something so simple to fix, it's like Predator going to eat your girl. I won't do that. What's getting the best of this place is laughing. Why you live a lifestyle of vagrant, an occupied tent, and the most prosperous, the greatest vagrant. What a bet. Now, I'm here, an agent of the United States. Now, I almost said government, and there is no such thing. <laughs> you know how much aspect there is the United States government, whether you are going to be able to say, the United States government, or especially when they're going to disavow knowing any of what you're talking about. Quit itching me. I just got an itch back here, and I find that repulsive. It's like having a cast on your leg when you're a kid, the damn thing's itching inside. And that ain't going to go away. See, I can't reach that. wonder why that happened. Right then! I call that fungus. That's a direct attack on this deliverance. Well, I'm going to deliver it anyway. You itching this my eyeball. It's very uncomfortable. It's like something going... Why? Why? Why when I asked a child, somebody had a question when I had the kid, somebody went... And she went... Her head went from me to... When she got done explaining to the interrupter, she went back to me and said, not enough time for you. Catch you later, maybe. Goodbye. That's the pattern of this one's life. Want to bet? Why? I start along before me. You say, well, you this and you that. My brother gonna say, you talk too much. I haven't said near enough. I talk too much. That crack came from my brother when I was this high. You know why? Because I was in hysterics, crying on his chest in agony. And he's saying, you talk too much. In hysterics, three years old. Three days old. Three days old! Three years old! Millions of generations old! What else would you do here, saith the Lord to me? Can you celebrate this as humanity? No, sir, I can't. Then don't! Is there any celebration fitting here right now? No. No. Those are all times of sackcloth and ashes. <laughs> Not walking around like this. 
we're going to water and ask him for collection of a currency that is the mass example of the worst corruption that's ever lived with the globe everywhere. They will take that in their plate. Why? Say the Lord to each one of them someday. I will. There's a judgment. You will get asked that question vividly in this tone of voice in front of your maker. As I'm chewing your maker out, not you. Let's see if you like it. Because you're going to go through it. Beg that day don't help me. I'll do it right now, too. That day is now. And in front of your maker, I chew your maker out for being so stupid to build you possible here. Why? I'll ask you, Lord, are these idiots doing this? Why, Lord? Like it? Because the Lord ain't answering. Funny how that works. And the Lord ain't going to answer because the Lord's not here. The rest of us are. Now the rest of us, why is it going on? And it ain't going on no longer, is it? Ah! That's like giving up your rights and let somebody search your car when they don't have the damn right to, isn't it? And they hate their job doing it. Because they know better, and they don't like doing it, and they just got to earn a living. Same as you, thief. Same as you, thief. Just earn a living. When you look what everybody else doing, there's no difference than searching somebody's car without rights. Every one of your positions in employment, you're searching cars without rights. Every one of you! For three and a half million years, because you won't give up the explanation to the weakest. You give up the explanation to the weakest. You get the picture in the weakest head. Let's see if they're violent. Move! All fixed. I'll be... Now, you still got a lot of work to do, don't you? All fixed. A lot of work! You ain't even touched the tip of the iceberg of chores around here. Ready to sweat now? Because now you're going to sweat for generations to fix the vagrant mess here. 